Hi, everyone. Welcome to Film Vets. I'm your host, Paul Dixon. With me is my co-host, Dan Young. Dan, how are you today? I'm tired. I'm so yeah, tired. Me too. How it's are you? It's so hot. I, it's, I'm hot. I'm it hot. Is. I'm tired, but I am excited because today we have the new trailer for Ahsoka. Oh, ho, ho. I was not oh, expecting yeah. that. I know. Let's watch it. Let's go. Let's just get into it. War is inevitable. One must destroy. Oh, dude. In order to create. We are no Jedi. Oh, yes. I started hearing whispers. Oh, His man. Return as heir to the Thrawn. Air. What happens when we find Thrawn? Power. Such as you've never dreamed. I've spent most of my life fighting a war. That's why Chopper. I'm trying to convince you to help me prevent another one. You and I both know who could help you with this. She's still just as stubborn as ever. I bet your master found you difficult at times. Anakin never got to finish my training. I walked away from him, just like I walked away from Sabine. Mm. You never made things easy for me. Ooh. Master. As a Jedi, sometimes you have to make the decision no one else can. But I'm counting on you to see this through. Nice haircut. <laughs> Sometimes we have to do what's right, regardless of our personal feelings. Buckle up. If we don't stop Thrawn, everything will be in vain. Oh, wow. He hey, looks great. No power. Looks amazing. Anakin spoke highly of you. I'm not here to discuss my past. We have a lot of work to do. Once a rebel, always a rebel. <laughs> oh, wow. That was the trailer for Ahsoka. Dan, I know you're excited. Tell me. Tell me what you think. <laughs> oh, my brain started <laughs> melting halfway through. Um, I know. Like yeah. this 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 show is going to have just a little bit of of everything. It's it's got ah, like I just <laughs> words. Use them. I can't. I can't. <laughs> I I just oh my god. I'm so excited to see them finally fold, you know, rebels into in the line was was perfectly placed once a rebel always a rebel but but to see them fold you know rebels and uh, ahsoka and and that whole story arc into the greater part of the story with a live action is something that i've been looking forward to since i've seen rebels yeah. to, to see what they do with that information to see thrawn uh it, it's it's gonna be amazing what thrawn do you think live action yeah, uh, I that's a lot of blue paint. I, yeah, uh, within the last month, saw Rebels for the first time, like all the way through. I never sat down to watch it till then, and it, I got I got so sucked into it. The story was so well done, the characters so mm -hmm. well done, and I I got into it because of the Ahsoka series coming, and I was like, well, let's. Well, let's see what the story's about, like with the cartoon version and see how it works. And I am just so excited that they're bringing the same actor that does the voices or the, the voice for Thrawn as Thrawn. And that actor is uh, he's uh, Mads Mikkelsen's brother, uh, Lars Mikkelsen. And he mm. is just a phenomenal actor. I, I've loved his work for a long time. And I know a lot of the stuff we're going to repeat from the last video we made, but uh, it's just, it, this looks phenomenal. And I, I, I want to say rip rest in peace. Uh, Ray Stevenson, what a great actor we lost. And this will be his final, I believe his final show or movie he's ever done or any character work he's ever done. Um, uh, just sad that we lost him, but so glad we're going to get him in this final performance. And mm -hmm. I, I'm really excited to see chopper chopper, such a, 
demented <laughs> little bastard. And he is so fun to watch. I, I, I will never forget the time I saw Rebels. The, the one scene that sticks out to me more than anything is Ezra Bridger hanging, dangling on the side of like one of those uh, platforms like mm-hmm. barely holding on and chopper runs over his fingers yep. <laughs> to get to the other <laughs> side. And you just hear Ezra go chopper. I just, I was like, Oh my God, this little bastard. It's a show with a lot of different personality. Like it's, it's not yeah. just one big personality dominate. It's not just Ahsoka, but it's all the way down to the droid has just as much personality as R2D2. Like, but I mean, the opposite, like it's, yeah. it's amazing how they, they really got Star Wars. Yeah. With, yeah. With well, what isn't, honestly, we're talking about like, heir to the throne. It's ironic. We talk about heir to the throne being Thrawn, but when mm-hmm. we really think about it, it's actually Dave Filoni taking over for George Lucas because he yep. is the real heir <laughs> That's to exactly the throne. What it was. Yeah. And I'm excited to see where this goes. I, I think uh, this could have the potential because of the buildup of the, the characters already there to be the next big Star Wars thing over any other show that's come out so far. Maybe the next Mandalorian. This is that, Ooh, you know. Yeah. So we'll see. What did you think of the trailer for Ahsoka? Are you excited for another Star Wars TV show? Do you think this will go the way of The Mandalorian or... Book of Boba Fett. Let us know in the comments below. Like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out our other segments and videos. Thank you so much, veterans, for watching and for your service. And thank you for joining me, Dan. Hell yeah. Dan, are you... You're still a Sith, right? I mean, you've never oh, gone absolutely. to Hand, the light down. side. Yeah. No, never. Never never been there. I tan too too easily. You, you tan too easily? That's why I don't go to the light side. Bye, everyone. <laughs> Bye.